Lifelines of Hope It is a national civil epic under the supervision of the Egyptian Armed Forces Engineering Authority, where hands join together to create a promising present and rise in development future befitting the Egyptian people. It is a national mega project that opens up more economic prospects and contributes to eliminating the traffic congestion in the Egyptian capital, connecting north and east of Cairo to Alexandria Desert Road, passing by the River Nile. It's a transversal freeway that shapes as a significant part of Zafarana Marsamatruh corridor. It fulfills the mechanism of linking two seas, the Red Sea and the Mediterranean Sea, starting from Zafarana area at the Red Sea, then to Al Galala Road, to Cairo Ain Sukhna Road, Al Shahid Corridor, to Al Fangari Corridor, then Dahya Masr Axis and Bridge, and finally towards Al Daba Axis and its future extension to Marsa Matruh. Dahya Masr Axis has its value augmented by linking the ring road to the regional ring road. Its first phase is 30 kilometers long, extending from Alexandria Desert Road Junction at the sign 39 up to the ring road junction at Al Warraq area. The second phase of the axis, which was integrated yesterday, extends from the ring road junction at Al Warraq area, passing by the western Nile, Al Warraq Island, and the eastern Nile up to the areas of Shubra to serve those coming to and from the Corniche, Nasser City, Autostrad Road, Heliopolis, Amiria, Sawah, and Shubra Al Khima. It is an iconic structure that would not show like that, but for the efforts of 4,000 engineers, technicians of highly skilled civilian construction workers, under the supervision of elite distinguished officers at the Egyptian Military Engineering Department. This, na this national edifice has taken 1 million cubic meters of concrete and more than 290,000 tons of steel. The architectural constructions, which represent 110% of the total surface area of the 6th of October bridge, implemented in 17 years, had been carried out here in less than 4 years by these men. The second phase of Tahya Misr Axis culminated in the construction of Tahya Misr Suspension Concrete Bridge, which is entitled to be listed in the Janus Book of World Records as the largest bridge in width around the world, 67.36 meters wide. The main body of the bridge is 5.6 kilometers long, in addition to 10 kilometers thus making the total length of the bridge 18 kilometers, including exit ramps and entrance ramps. The second stage of Tahya Masr Axis comprises the following system of bridges. 1. Ring Road Junction Bridge. Its main structure is 2 kilometers long, which is the length of 8 exit ramps and entrance ramps, amounts to 4.5 kilometers, with a width of 58 meters and fine traffic lanes in each direction. 2. The Western Nile Bridge It is a 370 meters long bridge with a width of 48 meters and 5 traffic lanes in each direction. It has navigation vents ranging from 70 to 120 meters long. 3. El Warraq Island Bridge The length of the bridge is 1.9 kilometers and the width of 48 meters. It comprises five traffic lanes in each direction. 4. Shubra Neighborhood Bridge The length of the main body of the bridges is 2.1 km. In addition to 5.1 km, represents the total length of 10 up ramps and down ramps, with varying widths ranging from 11 to 30 meters. These bridges serves those coming to and from Kurnish, Shubra, Al Mazalat, Nasr City, Odustrad. Amidst all this charm, the men have already completed this architectural edifice, realizing the presidential promise to build a lifeline of hope, which represents a platform of action through a new development access 
of all the opportunities of hope for a promising future in the Egyptian territory. 5. The Eastern Nile Bridge The crown jewel of Tahya Musr Access. The length of the bridge is 540 meters with a width of 67.3 meters. It has the largest navigation vent across the Nile with a width of 300 meters. It's also characterized by the existence of six traffic lanes in each direction. It consists of giant towers with a length of 92 meters in addition to a middle body with a total weight of 12,000 tons. Thus, the wheel of construction has spun to create the lifelines of hope.